All right, all right. Uh, hello, everybody, and welcome back to our YouTube channel BTC TV. And we continue to do videos about what is going on in the cryptocurrency market. And today, I'm happy to present you interview with organizer of one of the biggest conferences in the world, Block Show. And this is his name is Eddie. Nice to meet you. Hi, how are you doing, Eddie? Today? Hey, Max. Yeah, it's nice to meet you again, either. <laughs> and uh, pleasure to be here again mm -hmm. on. Uh, on your new <laughs> yes, channel. yes. Uh, I want a little bit to make more introduction about you uh, because Block Show. I was really amazing when I saw, when I visited this conference in Germany. This was the first mm -hmm. edition this year. Second edition was in Las Vegas, and now you are preparing uh, the last edition this year in Singapore. So let's firstly maybe let's. Tell us, because I, I didn't hear with you uh, about Las Vegas edition, how it was over there, what was uh, feedback from visitors? Oh, I loved uh, the Vegas edition. It was not our biggest one, so it was like for 1.5k mm -hmm. people. But um, it was really good in terms of uh, you know it's Vegas, yeah. so <laughs> <laughs> what's, what, what's, it was I guess stay in Vegas. <laughs> yeah, but what stays in Vegas stays. What hap What happens in Vegas stays in Vegas. The same uh, in blockchain, right? So it was really cool. Uh, I loved it. Mm. But till now, of course, our focus is Asia because uh, we are doing conferences since uh, 2016, and uh, the biggest one, and uh, I, my favorite one is in Singapore. Uh, so it's it's like turning into the blockchain annual summit in Singapore. So it will be second edition. And we are organizing not just Block Show Asia 2018, uh, end of November, but whole Asia Blockchain Week. Wow. So it's uh, hopefully it will be really, really valuable, and uh, and lots of people will uh, benefit from that. Uh, please tell us to our subscribers why Singapore? Why are you uh, making this conference in Singapore? Why not in Hong Kong or maybe in Tokyo? Why Singapore? Actually, starting from 2017, uh, I mean, like Singapore is becoming like. Uh, so it's it's a fintech center of Asia, mm -hmm. right? But really, starting from 2017, it's uh, in 2017 it was like the center of all of the ICOs. Mm -hmm. uh, in yeah, and then 2018 it's turning more into just real blockchain center. Lots of uh, foundations and startups open their offices there. Lots lots of accelerators and hubs. I mean, blockchain ones. Um, really, lots of um, happenings there. Not even conferences, like conferences are just coming into Singapore. There are lots of people, funds, <clears throat> based in Singapore as well, and lots of blockchain startups. So it's real center, um, and it's for me it's pretty natural that it's uh, in Singapore. So if you if you are I don't know in the blockchain business and you want to and you're traveling to Asia, I mean blo Singapore is uh, like number one priority for you. So that's that's why we have chosen it in 2017, and we continue organizing uh, co uh, block show Asia in Singapore. Uh, I love this. Uh, I cannot wait to to go to uh, Singapore to your conference. <laughs> it's your first time. You should. Yes, uh, I will definitely will go. Tell us about some numbers behind uh, this conference. Uh, in your opinion, uh, how many people will visit? Uh, how many speakers? Uh, ICO projects? Can you tell us a little bit? A little bit about numbers sure uh, frankly we are not really like following the numbers mm -hmm. so it's not our main mm -hmm. goal uh, <clears throat> anyway uh, you know everyone is interested yeah. in that so <laughs> right, yeah uh, right now right now we are focused on 2000 plus that's the least amount that we that we are focusing I don't know maybe it will be uh, much mm -hmm. more or it will be 2000 that's not the goal the goal is just to have 2,000 plus, and uh, that's that's what Block Show is usually about, 2,000 plus people. Um, as for speakers, the same, we're not following the goals. Mm -hmm. uh, right now we have like 40 plus, mm -hmm. uh, the website says 100 plus because it's usually what we have. Uh, if we have 80 plus, for example, I mean, I will be okay with that because the main thing is to have best speakers for the content that you want to provide to the people, okay. right? So the, we are really, really focused on the content, on covering the hottest topics and what's really valuable for the community now, what really will change the industry. It's like 
uh, all, all of these OTCs now, right? Um, investment, security tokens, and uh, um, topics that are really hot now and uh, pe that are pe people are discussing. So that's that's the focus. Of course, speakers like there will be uh, lots of big names. I don't want to play with mm -hmm. the names and uh, sell with the with the with the names. It's better just to look at the content, to look at the speaker lineup. Uh, in a couple of days, and uh, yeah, you will be pretty, pretty satisfied with that. The, st the goal is to bring value, so we are focused on the content. Okay, uh, I agree with you that uh, quality is most important here, and not about numbers. Yeah, because lots of conferences uh, now. It's... You know, when we started in 2016, there were like I don't know five of them. Right now, there are 500, yes. uh, maybe more. So lots of them. They I don't know. Uh, they pay the speakers to bring big names. They are doing lots of stuff. I don't want to play with the names, so I, I just say that we're focused on content, and that's it. I agree with you. Okay, uh, now uh, another question is about your agenda. What I saw, and for me is a little bit surprised, is to see open day at the December of first uh, at your conference. Yeah. Can you tell us what does it mean open day? What does it mean? Sure. So, um, you know, this blockchain week that we are doing from November 27 to December 1st, I mean, it's pretty different, mm -hmm. right? So we are starting like with the first day, then goes two days of block show on November 28, 29, then goes uh, on November 30, there is an event by Singapore University of Social Sciences and David Lee, which is a um, uh, pretty well-known figure in Singapore. They are organizing a free event for all of the people that will be in Singapore during this week there. Mm -hmm. And on December 1st, there is a, an idea uh, to open the hubs, the accelerators, and the offices of blockchain companies in Singapore to showcase what they are doing. Right, because there are lots of hype around. There are lots of people like selling something and so on. And we want to show. We want to really show that. I mean, blockchain is really about development. Mm -hmm. It's about people that are working to move the community and the pro and the products forward. So that's it. There will be uh, hackathons. There will be workshops. Some of the companies will just uh, do maybe some uh, open their offices to take a look at what they're doing. So it's a real like why we call it open day because all of them open their door excellent so we call it open day moreover we are also thinking of having multiple conferences inside block show because there are lots of events that w that are going to happen and we have like a pretty solid brand so why not offer uh to good events to good to good events with good content and agenda our place to uh, spread the word and uh uh, to bring to bring their knowledge and share it with people, so it will be a really valuable thing. So, hey, uh, excellent. And uh, usually at your conference, there is going to be award competition of the best project. Uh, is it going to yeah. be in Singapore edition as well? It's cool that you're asking about that actually, because <laughs> um, uh, we are removing mm -hmm. a simple that was called Block Show Oscar. Yes, something like that. Um, and it was just a standard startup competition, mm -hmm. right? So with a uh, with here, you know, right now we are. I mean, it's not yet uh, announced. <laughs> okay. Actually, your channel will be the first cool. to do that. I won't tell a lot about that, but we are launching a new format, uh, the new startup competition. I will tell the name. It will be called uh, EXP Twenty. Okay. So it's like it's it comes from the name of explosion, okay. right? So, but in crypto, it's EXP twenty, the protocol, mm -hmm. right? So, <laughs> it's, it it will be not just this a competition. It will be, a, um, so it comes from the idea that a competition is not that valuable for startups. Okay. So it's just a competition where they uh, compete and that's mm -hmm. it. But we want to create a real thing where startups, <clears throat> best startups, showcase themselves. And then, and uh, out of this showcasing, they can do lots of stuff. They can find valuable contacts. They can raise investments and so on. So we are inviting lots of people inside this EXP20 startup mm -hmm. show. That's what will be called. And uh, they will be sitting in front of uh, the startups pitching. Mm -hmm. And after that, these startups can get something from uh, these people. Wow. 
Uh, these people can be funds, that can be incubators, there can be different entities that can bring value to this stuff. Okay. So I think that it, it's much more uh, valuable for them, it's much more valuable for the ecosystem. And moreover, of course, it, it's a startup show. So we will be live streaming that, we will be creating out videos out of that, and uh, that will be a real uh, fun and a real show. But, you know, you should pack it into some product. But at the very end, it's, uh, we hope that it will, be, it will bring real value to startups uh, instead of just like competition that are happening all around uh, uh, the world. I agree with you. I love this idea because it's like now I understand why you are calling this exposure because it's like from one pitching you can get, if your project is a good one, you can get a really a lot of things like funds, you can get mass media co coverage, uh, very valuable connections. And uh, and people will choose with, with with whom to work. I mean, like investors will choose here, and not like only like a couple of judges uh, on, in a regular competition. Absolutely true, and it's you can call it XP twenty. It's exposure. It's explosion. It's exponent, mm. right? So it can be called whatever you want. But excellent. Yeah. Uh, at the very end, value. okay. Yeah. Uh, I know that your time is very valuable. Before we will finish, I want to ask you one thing because during the last uh, months, we are doing uh, competitions with all uh, who are coming to our channel. Usually, there are something giving like uh, something to our subscribers uh, for the best mm -hmm. questions. So, how about idea that uh, we will make a competition with our subscribers and they will ask interesting question about your conference? In a couple of days, you will okay. select a winner, which will get free access, free ticket to your conference. Is it a good one? Sure, let's do that. Let's do that. Um, questions about the yes. event that can be, that can be not particularly about the event, maybe, but about what's going to okay. be right? uh, at the event or during this blockchain week or something. Uh, maybe they will propose something, so it can be a question or a proposition. Okay. And uh, the most interesting and valuable comment we will choose, give them free ticks. And uh, yeah, and uh, to those who participate, we can, uh, but they will not win, we can give a very good discount. Sounds amazing. So uh, guys, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, leave an interesting question below this video, and Eddie Chris uh, will select uh, the best one in a couple of days, which will get free ticket to one of the biggest conference in the world and uh, I think that even you can meet him personally during the conference as well. Actually meeting me it's not but meeting all of the <laughs> yes, people that um, fun. But, yeah because uh, me I'm, I'm, a, I'm organizing <laughs> for you guys so it's better meet not me but the people coming to <laughs> I me. agree with you. All right Ed, thanks a lot for again for your time for your interview and I, again I cannot wait to see you in real time in real life in, in the Singapore. Same Max happy to be uh, on your <laughs> channel and uh, hi to everybody see you in Singapore. Okay.